Hey guys, it's this little cloth here, and today inside of this Monster Legends Guides video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to get the brand new corrupted mythic named Olafantic. So I definitely stress that you guys try to get this monster because it is actually a mega taunt monster. So I can definitely see it being used in all of the different metas. So yeah, definitely try to get it. So now let's get into how you can do that. So the first way is through a breeding event. So you can breed the past two Legends Pass monsters to actually get this monster. And the past two Legends Pass monsters were Vishama and Chimney. Those were the free ones. Or you can use the Dew and Hacksmith, but you cannot breed the Dew and Hacksmith together. You can only breed Vishama and the Hacksmith together or the Dew and Chimney together. So if you got Vishama and Chimney or the Dew and Chimney or Vishama and the Hacksmith, you can breed those combos together, or you can breed both of those combos together, and you can have an even higher chance of getting him. But apparently, it is a very high chance to get him. But yeah, this is the little visual, and you can also get these legendaries, which aren't that good. You should really be trying to get all of Fantic, but I guess you don't really have a choice if you get the legendaries. So yeah, and then you can also get it through the Fraternity event. So basically how this works is if your teammates or if you buy gems, your whole team will get mythical cells. So you can actually get the whole monster this way if your teammates buy gems or if you buy gems. And you can give your whole team this monster. So yeah, definitely worth it if you guys want to do this. And don't give your team war coins, give them the mythical cells. Because giving them war coins is kind of a waste. So yeah, and then we also have a little visual for the monster itself. As I said, it does have Megaton at rank 3, and at rank 1, I think that's like Curse Immunity or something, and at rank 0, it has Hardened, which gives a 20% less chance of it getting hit with negative status effects, which is really good. So yeah, overall, this monster seems pretty great. We did go over his moveset a few days ago, and he definitely seemed pretty good. And yeah, that's going to be it for this video. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.